and we are back in the kitchen guys and both my dolls have had an hour at the auto lease stage so it's time to add the salt and um, work on them now give them a bit of kneading so but first of all like I said I have now named my starter dolls Bill and Joan so I'm just going to stick their names onto them and there is Joan and we can get him off there is Bill and yes Bill and Joan are named after two family friends they probably have a laugh about that so that's Bill and Joan the start of those I'm going to chuck them over there out of the way and let's get on with doing this dough so what are we going to do work on this one first I'm going to dip my hands into the flour that's probably still a bit sticky I have weighed 10 grams of rock salt in goes the salt and I find it easier to use one of these scrapers now to move it round for a bit. Let's gather all this together. Turn it out onto the flour surface. This stage is probably going to be a little bit sticky. So this is where you're going to have to use flour. This is the kneading process. You're just pushing it into the middle, like so. And look at that. I can actually feel the rock salt in it. That is quite a nice dough, to be honest. It's not going to take much of this kneading before I'm going to pop it back in the bowl. Now that is a nice dough. So I'm going to pop that back in there. Put that back on. And we're going to do exactly the same with the second one. So on goes the rock salt. Let's get this one out of here. This is a little bit more sticky than the first one. So a little bit more flour onto the surface. Just make sure you've got lots of flour on your hands and you're not going to stick to it. And this is all we're doing for a minute. We're giving it a good knead. It does recommend doing this if you do it by hand. Knead it for about nine minutes. But to be honest, I can tell already, probably a little bit out of breath, but I can tell already how good this dough is and this is not going to need 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 in for nine minutes definitely not so sorry about this i have walked two miles today i'm a little bit out of breath and i am 63 by the way so just thought i'd chuck that in there so yeah there we go that oh that is gorgeous that is a lovely feeling dough so we're going to pop that back in that bowl, cover that over, and I've got to leave them for, bear with me, uh, uh, uh. right, so we're going to cover those and leave them for 30 minutes, so Alexa, time 30 minutes, no, Alexa's not listening, Alexa, time 30 minutes, 30 minutes, starting now, so, I'm going to clean up. So let's have a quick recap of what we've done today. We originally fed our starter doughs. Then we used 460 grams of white plain flour in each mix. There was 300 grams of sourdough starter into each mix. Along with 230 grams of tepid water. We've just added 10 grams of sea salt to each one. 
and after leaving each one for an hour we've now kneaded them for a couple of minutes into a nice elasticated dough and we're going to leave them there for half an hour after the half an hour we're going to be working on each dough pulling the dough which i will video and we have to do this round about four or five times before we put them in the baskets ready to put in the fridge and leave them then to bake tomorrow morning